Hi, future foresters. My name is Carl Turnland, and I am the Director of Residence Life. My job here is to briefly introduce you to the Office of Residence Life, and I'm going to do that through this brief Residence Life 101 presentation. The goal of the Office of Residence Life, broadly speaking, is to help you make Lake Forest College your home away from home. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about what that's all about. This is me. I use pronouns like he, him, and his. I serve as the Director of Residence Life at the college, which means I provide leadership to all elements of the residential experience. I've been at the college for four years and I'm actually a graduate of a small private, highly residential liberal arts college, just like Lake Forest. So when I came to st start working here, I felt like this was a homecoming. Um, residence life in a place like Lake Forest is an amazing foundational level experience that many of our students have. I'm gonna talk to you briefly about residence life by the numbers, but I'm also gonna tell you a little bit about who residence life is, what it is that we do. Always, you can access information about housing, residence life, and campus culture in general on our website. Specifically for residence life, you're going to want to go to lakeforest.edu slash reslife. So let me tell you a little bit about residence life by the numbers. We have a three-year residency requirement, meaning that we privilege, we prioritize, and believe deeply in the fact that if you live where it is that you learn and you have a co-curricular experience that supplements your in-class learning, you have a more robust, more successful, and more, honestly, a more like thorough and beautiful experience. So we house you across 10 different residence halls that are all on three different areas of campus. Take, taking a quick peek at the campus map, you'll see there's a south campus, a middle campus, and a north campus. And the beautiful thing is we have residence halls that are sort of sprinkled all throughout. We hire 41 student staff leaders in our residence halls. We call those resident assistants. I'm going to tell you a little bit more about our staff roles in just a moment. We also hire four master level professional staff to support the RAs and each residence hall in turn. But of course, residence life is a lot more than just the numbers. We also have a ton of things that we do that are memorable, that are iconic. They, they just, they work so well for our campus because we are that kind of community. So you'll see students in residence halls doing things like study sessions. You're going to have game nights. You're going to see things like cookouts, but we also involve bigger programmatic elements, really fun things. One of our um, like science faculty members, chemistry specifically, does this wonderful workshop about chocolate tasting. Just one example of how faculty are involved in the residence halls. We also host discussions that sometimes feel a little bit more academic in nature. All of these things happen in beautiful synthesis and in congruence with the college mission. We want to make sure that your experience is great from point A to point B, whether you're a resident for your entire time at the college or not. So let me tell you a little bit about our people in the Office of Residence Life. Now, as an office that falls within student support, the Office of Student Affairs by title, we're here to support you. We believe really deeply in the residential experience. We believe that you benefit from being a resident, um, but we also understand that every person needs a person. At least that's what the research tells us. So we have two different versions of staff that work in our office. On the one hand, we have our student staff I mentioned earlier, the resident assistants. They're your go-to people for any questions you have about how campus works truly. They are peer leaders. They are community builders. They are folks who have gone through these processes before. They understand kind of what's at stake, how to navigate. They're really phenomenal point people. They're also just really phenomenal people in general. Residence directors support the resident assistants in their support of you. Residence directors abbreviated to RD also will support you directly. They have their master's degree in higher education administration or a related field, which means they are very well positioned to help you get your needs met. That could be academic related, but we also make referrals to a lot of campus offices. The Center for Academic Success, our Health and Wellness Center, the Gates Center, which is our student activities office, our leadership office. Residence life is connected to all of those places. And our role as professional staff is to make sure that you are also connected. We know that students who feel like they belong tend to perform better academically. And when you have a point person, you also find greater success after college. We manage all kinds of student support. That could look like roommate conflicts. That could look like anything in between. Um, it's all fair game as far as we're concerned. Because remember, we're here to support you. These are our three residence directors. Ideally, someday you'll be able to meet them. 
but like I said, they are very supportive of, of all of our students, but most especially our incoming new students, people who are learning the, the college, the environment, the landscape, all of it. Allison, Ronan, and Alundra are just really phenomenal supporters of the campus community. You'll definitely see them around. Now, you're making some really important college decisions. You need to consider what kind of support you're gonna need, what sort of academic program you wanna pursue. Really, it's about visualizing where you see yourself. So let me tell you a little bit about how that process works once you decide that Lake Forest College is the right place for you. We'll collect a housing contract from you, which is basically an expression of your commitment to living on campus. We also then do this really cool roommate matching system where you'll be able to input a bunch of information about yourself, your preferences, all of those kind of things. And then our software pairs you with people who have a good percentage match, right? From there, we weigh out preferences. We weigh out roommate matches. You're able to have a lot of agency, a lot of selection and all of that process. We assign rooms sort of going into every fall semester, but we do it based on preferences. We do it based on your roommate matching. Um, and we're in touch with you at all points all throughout the summer going into the fall of your first year. This was very brief, an overview of who we are, what we do, and some of the ways in which we help make Lake Forest be your home away from home. I'm sure you have more questions. We will be hosting office hours during Forester Scholars Weekend. We're also always available by email at reslife at lakeforest.edu. Again, my name is Carl. I'm the Director of Residence Life, and I can't wait to get to know you. Thanks, everybody. We'll see you soon.